city, Tokyo. Like all cities on the face of this planet, Tokyo is losing the battle against man's deadliest enemies, waste and pollution. Despite the efforts of local and world government, the air, the sea and the land may soon lose their ability to support life of any kind. Who will help? Spectre Man. He's coming, sir. Yes, I can see that. Hmm. Well, shall we? Oh, yes, sir. We shall. <laughs> Dr. Gory? Yes, I am. And you are the emissary from the planet Janus. We have been awaiting you, my friend. The reason I had you come to this planet was to help me annihilate all of the people here. Well, do you have any suggestions as to procedure? I do. It's called Operation Genocide. Oh, Operation Genocide? Exactly. We'll make the Earthlings kill each other off. It's very simple. Good. Explain yourself. Our scientists on Yenos have concluded that killing all the Earthlings by using atomic weapons would be foolish. Mankind would disappear, but the planet Earth would be uninhabitable for centuries. And what would that gain us? Nothing. I agree, but you still haven't explained just how Operation Genocide would work. Yeah. Like oh. this. <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, you can't frighten me. <laughs> Oh, 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 that really hurts, oh, 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 Karras, Karras, good Lord, he's dead, he's killed him, oh, Karras, yes, well, why did you kill him? As an experiment? Well, I'll kill you. Wait, Dr. Gori. I'll bring him back to life you now. What? Here. Watch. What in the name of seven galaxies are you doing? <laughs> why, why, that's marvelous. Why, he's alive. I was worried there for a time, Karras. Kill. What's gone into you? Kill. Control yourself, Karras. Come, what is that, you fool? Kill. My secret formula has brought him back to life, but I've turned him into a killer. Janus, help me, will you please help? Oh, oh, oh my head. Oh. Uh, what is that formula? Karras, uh, let go of me. Karras, stop now. Uh, Come on. All right. Uh, yes, new master. Oh. Uh, all right. Just what is that formula? 
It took years for our leading scientists to develop this magical drug. We call it our killer formula. A killer formula? This is the heart of Operation Genocide. Genocide. By producing this killer formula in mass quantities, we'll create thousands of bloodthirsty murderers oh. all over the planet. Right. Before long, every man, woman, and child on Earth will be dead. A masterful plan. The Earth will be crushed, and I will be her ruler. <laughs> 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 to Operation Genocide! Oh, to Genocide! To genocide. <laughs> this boy's name is Johnny Heiter. His parents are dead, and he's being raised by his aunt and uncle. Johnny is gifted with the mysterious power of extrasensory perception. He is often able to predict what will happen in the future. But no one is aware of this. I feel strange. There's danger outside, I know that. I'll call headquarters. Police headquarters? Come quick. You call the police? What's wrong here? Oh, we didn't call you. Someone here called police headquarters, I'm sure. I'm sorry. N no one here called the police. I did it. I called the police. You did. Why did you do that? Officer, I had to tell you. The Earth is in danger. Invaders from space are going to attack. Huh? Are you sure of this? Officer, if you don't act quickly, time is going to run out. Please, Johnny, I told you to stop doing this. I'm sorry, this is really embarrassing. The boy's imagination is a little overactive, and he's always making up these stories. Mm. Look, it's the truth! Be quiet now. I'm sorry to say this. Johnny often embarrasses us in the neighborhood. Please forgive us. I'll promise we'll watch him from now on. We're really terribly sorry. You're lucky. We won't do anything to you this time, Johnny. Good day. Goodbye. Really? not your fault. You were in a real hurry, huh? But I don't know where to go. Huh? You know what? They're going to try and kill all of us. Who is? The invaders. They're going to try and kill us. So that's why we have to act right now. No. What's going on? What's happening? My head hurts. It happens every time I make a prediction. You're not a human. I could tell the second I saw you. You know that's the truth, don't you? No, it's not. Why do you say that, Johnny? I have a feeling you're some sort of spaceman or something, right? I'd better go. Why won't anyone listen to me? There's danger. George was deeply disturbed by his meeting with Johnny. How could his true identity be unmasked by a little boy? Johnny's prediction about an impending disaster was right. A tragedy occurred in the heart of the city that very evening. <laughs> you can't catch me. Woo! <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Look out now. <gasps> oh, 